Alligator Creek in Callahan, Florida, which is on US Highway 1, just north of the small downtown city part of Callahan. Let's see, it is probably half a mile from where 301 crosses. I actually thought this was on 301. But this is Alligator Creek. Guys, it is small. This was a scene in the American Revolutionary War. I believe it was June 30th, 1778, where the Americans took a loss here. There, it was a cavalry uh, against the British. Americans lost 13, British lost 9. And, uh, there is a marker. Let me show you the marker. Can you guys see just how thick the Florida woods are? Being from the north, they just cannot appreciate just how thick these woods are. You hear a lot of background traffic, guys. It's because the uh, we're right on U.S. Highway 1, which goes from Key West, Florida, all the way up to Maine. If you ever been to Key West, you go to Mile Marker Key West. Here is the uh, historical marker and um, it is right in the parking lot, I guess it would be considered the southeast parking lot of Cedar River Seafood. Let me see if I can squeeze in and get that so you can see what it looks like. That's one of the... Here is the, it's called the Skirmish of American Revolution. June 30th, 1778, a force of 300 American cavalry commanded by Colonel Elijah Clark participating in General Robert Howe's invasion of Florida attacked a column of British at this place, Alligator Creek Bridge, but were unable to penetrate the nearby entrenchment of 450 British regulars and South Carolina Royalists under the command of Major James Mark Prevost. In this skirmish, Colonel Clark was wounded and the Americans withdrew. The next day, the British retired in the direction of the St. Johns River. Casualties, American 13, British 9. And this sign was erected in 1936. And it looks pretty worn out, pretty worn down. get a chance come on out and visit it tell your kids this is a great if you're doing some studies on the American Revolution it'd be great to show your kids this you know gives them a tactile uh, feel to the American Revolution who would have thought in Florida that they were part of the American Revolution this is Neil Stagner signing in have a great day God bless bye